We'd like to warn you before we get into the story, you're just going to be saying aw for the next about two and <laughs> yes, a half minutes. Overload of yeah, the cuteness. Exactly. <laughs> Young Williams keeping themselves incredibly busy this holiday season. Yeah, we reported to you that taking in, they took in 40 beagles. And since then, since they were rescued from Virginia, every one of them has been rehomed and, of course, just in time. For the holidays, our Ellie Bird spoke with the owners and with the foster parents of the Beagles. Ellie, first off, how are the dogs doing? Brittany, it's such an exciting time. Young Williams Animal Center has finally found the forever homes for the 40 of the Beagles that they also helped rescue from Virginia. In early August, Young Williams took in the first group of around 20 Beagles, all removed from a mass breeding facility. In Vigo facility in Cumberland, Virginia, had more than 4,000 beagles being held in terrible conditions. Savannah Russell, who fostered but now owns one of the beagles, Daisy, says she's already a member of the family. I literally call her Crazy Daisy. <laughs> um, she was super shy at first, and then um, she just kind of meshed into our family. So like a week later, we were just like, uh, we can't get rid of her. I was crying about it, even like thinking about giving her up. So uh, we, we decided that having a girl dog, our first girl dog, was totally worth it. We were told the Beagles were being bred for medical research and testing. The Invigo facility is still under investigation. The rescue was a monumental project for the Humane Society because of the large number of rescues it took in. All right, Ellie, with that many dogs, was it possible to find enough people to foster them or take them in? Well, luckily, credit to Young Williams, they have a great system of fosters on hand and a list also taking applications. And they also provide items for the foster families to help them out as well. Mm. And I know that there was uh, quite a few people who In were on In this newsroom alone, list. oh my goodness, yes, we'd have taken <laughs> home every 41 of them if we could. Ellie, thank you, ma'am.